In this video, I'm going to show you how you can cast the UK TV Play app from your Android smartphone over to your Google Chromecast plugged into your television. So the first thing you need to do is to make sure that your Google Chromecast is set up and is plugged into your television and is on the same Wi-Fi network as your smartphone. The second thing you'll need to do is to download the UK TV Play app from the Google Play Store. So depending on your phone, you need to find all the apps. Usually this is done by swiping up from the screen. You should then see all your apps and scroll down to the letter P. And under P you should see the Google Play Store, so click on the play icon here. So when that opens up, in the top search box just type in UK TV and UK TV Play, you can see here, so click on that. So once the app opens up, you can then download and install the app. I've already downloaded and installed it. This is a free download. It should take around 30 to 45 seconds to download and install. So once that's um, installed on your phone, you can open up the app. Okay, so once the app loads, you have access to the UK TV Play network. So this includes channels such as Drama, Really, Yesterday, Dave and Home. It doesn't include any of the kind of subscription based services such as um, um, Eden, Alibi, um, UK Gold and so on. So you will need to register uh, an account, just basically enter your email address and a few details about yourself such as your name and your postcode. This is pretty simple to do. So once the app opens up, click on the three dots, dashes in the top left hand corner and just select sign in slash register. Then if you haven't got an account, just click on register now. Just go through the, through the process. You may have to verify your email account for it to work. Sometimes you don't have to, but you may have to, but it's pretty simple. So once you've done all that, sign in. So once you sign in, this will be stalled every time so you don't have to sign in again. So I'm now signed in, so all those details will be saved. So every time you open the app, everything is ready to go. So you can just browse the app for different programs you can see here you can also click on the dashes again in the top corner and select categories and you can choose whatever category you want such as documentaries you can also use the search bar here in the top right hand corner and type in the program you're looking for and so on so if i choose a program let's say let's choose expedition with steve backshaw so to cast to your chromecast device plugged into tv all you literally have to do is click on the little TV icon, which is located in the top right hand corner. You can click on this icon anytime you like. You can either choose a program first and then select the icon. You can even start playing the program and select the icon again. Or you, know, you, do, you can just click it anytime you want. So browse the program you want. So for example, I want this one here. Select that. So I can either click play now and select the, the cast icon or I can click the cast icon right now. So I'm going to click it here. And then you select your Chromecast from the list. In my case, I have two Chromecasts, one downstairs, one upstairs in my bedroom. So I'm going to select my bedroom. And then you should see on your TV screen in the next kind of five to 10 seconds, you should see UK TV play ready to cast is displayed on your TV screen. Once that's displayed, simply click the play icon on the app, click play, and then hopefully within the next kind of five to 10 seconds, that program should start playing on your TV. It will play some um, ads as is indicating here, but once the ads are over, the actual program will start playing. And it's really as simple as that. And you can see on the bottom of your smartphone here, you can see a timeline, so you can go backwards and forward. You can also pause the video here and restart the video. So it's really as simple as that. So once the ad stop, stops playing, the main program will start playing. And it's, 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 that's all you have to do. So that's how you can do it. Thanks for watching.